All right, guys. We're gonna go and have a look at a new camping spot. We're just waiting for this Yobo to get out of the way here. Ah, uh, we're in a place called Wild Horse, just south of uh, the Sunshine Coast, Wild Horse Mountain. And I got my mate Jake's going to show me a camping spot. Now this is not a designated camping spot, but this is one of those camping spots that the uh, locals kind of go to. So uh, it's on the banks of the Pumastone Passage, so it should be a uh, reasonable fishing place. Look out, Yobbo here is going crazy. So, uh, yeah, so uh, if you do come out camping here and the police come and tell you to uh, leave, don't go saying the wandering Aussies sent you out here. Because <laughs> that's just the way it is. It's, it's a locally known place. So we're on the, uh, we just left the Wild Horse Mountain. Um, you got to drive part, oh, here we go. We get off to the Wild Horse Scenic Lookout. So this is the way you take. Oh, well. Okay, so, yep. Yeah. Go straight ahead. It's a gravel road, but seeing Jake's taking his ute over it, it can't be too bad. <laughs> it does have a couple of bumps. Now it's only a few k's down the road here. And uh, as you can see we're going through a pine forest. We were going to go camping here but unfortunately uh, yeah, I can't go camping for a bit. Which I'll explain at a later date. <laughs> You're probably going to have to mark this turn off up here. It's not like on GPS or something. It's yeah. Some, sometimes the camera will the same. Okay, guys, so we're coming off with ah, uh, turn off on the road, we got to turn off. This is something you're just going to have to figure out because it's not marked. But basically, it's like the first turn off, isn't it? Really? Yeah, the major, major turn off. First got the major on the tree. Uh, turn off. There is an uh, arrow painted on the tree, blue. So you got to look for that. As Jake gently accelerates, <laughs> we're in a holding here, guys. It can't be helped. <laughs> He's got a coke can called Revhead. Don't know why. Yeah, probably the road. You want to go right here? Okay, so we're coming up to a fork in the road, guys. So you got to turn right where you see that four-wheel drive has just come around the corner. You got to follow where he came from. Basically, that's two rights. The first right back there, then a right here. Down there, but it's four drive track. Okay, 
So we turn left at this T-section, little T-section. Turn around. this little track and there's the creek that's probably one of the tributaries into the pumice stone passage and as you can see it's not a big area see where campfires have been Bit of rubbish here, Shane. They leave their rubbish, eh? Because that fucks. That ruins everything. It right? ruins everything. They'll close it all off. Really, the council should turn this into a uh, a proper camping spot. Okay, we're gonna get out and have a look. Okay, so apparently there are little camping spots just down and around. This is the creek, it's quite a nice looking creek actually. If you got kayaks or canoes, be ideal. Okay, so from this camp spot, we're going to walk over to another one that's in walking distance. Looks like you can drive through there. But I don't know if you'd take your new Commodore through here, though. This looks like a really good little fishing creek, to tell you the truth. Yeah. Well, every time we come to fish down, we usually catch brim. You know. Yeah, you get your brim and... Occasional jacks. Occasional jacks. Some good snags, I'd say. It would be good jack country. Mm. Um... Open east, tiny, yeah. You can see where people are leaving rubbish, so you're just wrecking it for other people. Yeah. You come here, pick the sh pick your, your crap up and take it home with you. Otherwise the council's liable to come along and cl close it all off for other people. But it's definitely a good little place, especially if you want to throw the line and do a little bit of fishing. Somebody's left the crab pot here. That'd be another thing the river, it looks like it would be good for is crabs, crabbing. 